Hey everyone, how's it going? Thanks so much for tuning in. For today's video, we're going to be taking an in-depth look at the 2018 Kia Optima LX. Now this vehicle came with a 2.4 liter 4 cylinder engine which is paired with a 6 speed automatic gearbox. And my goal with this video is to teach you everything you ever wanted to know about it. In this review, we'll start the engine and show it off, go through the performance data, and I'm going to strap on the GoPros and take it for a test drive and show you many of the few features in the interior as well as exterior. So without further ado, let's go and start her up, let it run. Now this particular Optima does come equipped with the integrated smart key system, so you're able to wirelessly lock in and lock the vehicle. My question just put your key fob in your pocket. Tap this button once to lock. One beep indicates locking, and your mirrors will automatically tilt in and have to wait a second. Tap the button again. Two beeps indicate unlocking, and your mirrors will automatically tilt out. This exterior color on the Optima is pearl, featuring black cloth interior. Push button start is also standard on the Optima, so if you want to start, all you have to do is to make sure you have the key fob inside the vehicle, put your foot on the brake, and hit the dash mode button to go. Now the Optima does come equipped with a rec and pinion power steering, the three spoke leather wrapped steering wheel with all your multifunction controls over here, your radio controls, your hands free telephone and voice commands over here. As far as transmissions, the Optima LX does come equipped with a six speed automatic gearbox with manual shifting over here. Put the vehicle in reverse. You have your backup camera also with guidance lines. Alright, so anyways, we're going to go ahead and flip on the headlights. does have automatic lights and hazards. Now the Optima LX does come equipped with an automatic driver's side window. Same on the passenger side there. And we'll check out the exterior, shall we? And when you're closing the door and carrying the key fob with you, the vehicle will chime a few times. It'll let you know if the proximity key fob has left the vehicle's interior. Now the Optima LX does come equipped with a gasoline direct injected 2.4 liter double overhead cam 4 cylinder engine and it delivers 185 horsepower at 6,000 RPM and 178 foot pounds of torque at 4,000 RPM. As you can see that the car does have all your two different drive modes selected by this button right over here. I'll show you. Um, you have your active eco management over here. And that will actually gear the transmission a little bit differently. Shift quicker at lower RPMs. It does decrease some of the thirst for fuel. And if you push it again, you have sport mode right over here. It's really cool. And this vehicle does have a touch screen with an AM FM radio with CD player and as well as hands-free telephone and Bluetooth. And as you can see over here on the touch screen you can tap play or pause if you want. Or you can control it right from the steering wheel, the volume. Or you can mute it if you want by tapping this button here. It's a very nice feature, but uh, as you can see over here on the screen over here, information screen, you can control the trip B, trip A, um, fuel range and average fuel economy. And if you push this button, um, service interval for oil changes and stuff like that, user settings, customize your settings if you like, other features. you the manual shifting right now. I'm going to go to second gear. First. It's really nice. Fourth gear. Back to drive.
looking truck, Chevrolet Silverado. That's the kind of truck that I like to get. Like a work truck or LT, 2500. Either the Duramax diesel or the 6.6 .6 liter V8 gas engine. I might get either that or the GMC Sierra. Now on the climate controls over here, you can change the blower fan speed, change all the different zones, temperature, front and rear defrost, air conditioning. And down below over here, it does have heated seats and heated steering wheel, drive mode control like you saw earlier. And if you open this, you have your two 12 volt power outlets and uh, aux in and USB over here. Hook up your iPod there. And this vehicle does have the owner's manual over here. Glove box. Really cool. And the steering wheel over here is also a simple clean design over here. You also have your voice commands over here. We'll show that. Please say a command after the beep. Help. Help. You can say a frequency like FM 89.1 or AM 1080, a preset number like preset 1, scan, or preset scan, for help with other modes. Say more help after the beep. More help. More help. Here are some examples of mode commands. You can say a radio type like FM, AM, or satellite. You can also say a media source like USB, My Music, or iPod. Additionally, there are phone commands like contacts, call history, or dial number. You can find more detailed commands in the user's manual. Please say a command after the beep. Cancel. Cancel. It'll walk you through everything. It's really cool. Already. We'll go shut her down. And we'll check out the rest of the vehicle. Back seat is a perfect place to sit inside the Optima. Room for five people. You also have your storage pocket over here. Storage pocket on that side there as well. Looks pretty good. Same smart key system on the passenger side there. Really cool. Storage pocket over here as well. Um, really cool. Really nice. Now we'll check out the trunk here. It's all extra cargo space over here. Really cool. Put your spare tire in here. Very nice. Well, everyone, I hope you enjoy my review on the 2018 Kia Optima LX. Be sure to stay tuned next time for more videos just like this. And remember, as always, like, subscribe, favorite, and don't forget to check out my other videos as well. Once again, be sure to stay tuned next time. There's always a lot more where it came from. Take care.